Hello, ma'am. Can I see Mr. CEO? Identify yourself. Name, age, bank account balance. Well, okay. Angelo. Older than you think. And why the hell you need my balance? <laughs> Mr. CEO won't speak with you if your fortune isn't big enough to make him drool. Listen, I have a message from his very important message. Believe me. Mr. Angelo, I trust nothing but papers only, not even the Internet. I classify people by two folders with journals. One carries the list of visitors. It's always on my left. The second one is for checking special personnel who fix, clean, and are being paid poorly. Always on my right side. So just drop a line in the visitors list. It is impossible. Visitors can be added only by Mr. CEO's direction or to comply with his requirements. You look like a teenager who doesn't know what to do. Also, you're neither rich enough nor famous, and there's no dirty work here that I can give you either. Look, I'm a blogger. It is very useful for Mr. CEO to talk with me for his public image. That's true. Report to me the number of your subscribers. Um, a million. Almost. Sorry, Mr. Angelo. Only numbers starting from three million can make Mr. CEO grin. <coughs> Did you hear all that lady said? I'm a bit afraid of her. Where is this money coming from? Stolen? Well, yes. When I bought this first one, you know, offshore can't say a lot. It's hard to say this, but no. I'm planning to return to my world and don't want to meet that account holder. I can fix the number of your stuff easily. I usually get a pay for this. But for only for you to charge. No. Too suspicious. People will shout such big increase in subs. In the end, I'll get more unsubscribes. Okay, Mr. Frank. Send more. If you need me. And don't want to go. Then write to the net house. For talking with yourself. Use that keyboard. Please avoid unauthorized touching of anything here. Maybe I need to visit the WC? I don't have you on the WC visitors list. It says, young sharks required to eat people. I saw your company is recruiting. How can I apply? What can you do? Well, I can ask people to donate to me while I'm relaxing. This skill can be marked as acceptable. Please give me your email. And the computer will send you an application form. I got that, B. Just ask me where keyboard. If you need a bag. I'll have to use it before I can make it un- <coughs> You need to graduate from an expensive college to touch them, young man. You need to graduate from an expense to touch them, young. It says <coughs> 
Fancy hard. What a fancy coffee machine you have. Do you brew it for people in another special folder? I operate this machine when Mr. CEO wants me to. Let him take my free advice. It's harmful to drink a lot of coffee. Caffeine helps Mr. CEO to get through the thrill when the stock exchange rises. All right, do your trick. Make her boss cry while looking at his screen. I love to do the same for my viewers. Watch One change is done. Journals changed. Repeat the procedure. <coughs> oh no, the machine isn't working. You didn't try! Papers never lie, young man. But I have to bring Mr. CEO a coffee. It's a matter of life and death, literally. Well, I can deal with that machine, lady. Believe me. You really can? I was going to call a service, but you could try. Fix it faster. I'll try to calm him down with news about his competitor's bankruptcy. That's the kind of job I can handle. Okay, lady. Your infernal machine is fixed. But orders are orders. I must list you as a worker. Your name again? Angelo. Just Angelo. Is there some reward for helping? Do it again. I need her out one more time. Server security? Firewalls? IP tracers? Now the journals are back in their places. Could you check the visitors list again, please? Maybe you'll find my name. I checked not long ago, Mr. Angelo, and you weren't there. But you did me a favor, so as an exception, I'll look into it again. Hmm. Weird. Now I see your name, 
written by me? Is that some kind of trick? Papers don't lie, remember? You may enter Mr. CEO's office, Mr. Angelo. <coughs> Hello, Mr. Rich. You have 30 seconds for free. Then you either tell something useful for me, or pay me for talking. I have a message from your dad. Wait, what? Is my dear father alive? Well, I talked to him, but not sure about his physical status. So who the hell are you? I'm a messenger from hell. Well, well, well. So my dearest father is where he belongs. Great news. Now we can talk for free. What message did he send? He wants to warn you about his partners, who poisoned him. You have to look inside the Midas statue for papers that can help you withstand them. Good. So good. Glad to hear you're happy. But you have to tell me the password. Kind of delivery confirmation. Sure. But first... Let me give another message to him. It was I who poisoned him. You? But why? Weren't you rich enough? Being his son! I was following his lessons. He always told me to be about profit before anything else. I found dirt on our competitors inside the Midas statue. It wasn't a very creative stash. I set up daddy's partners with father's death used the dirt to finish off their business, and got on top. I've implemented the most effective plan, in which Dad was... an obstacle. Now I'm even better than my father. He can be proud. Oh, and about your password. Deceive. Inveigle. Obfuscate. Hacker, please take me back to hell, cause I'm scared. Now I know Kung Fu. Can we kind of chat with you? Ha, huh, not a problem. But I'm not sure if you are mentally capable of talking with me. Please, Angelo, let my fist kiss one of his faces. Are you some program? Like in Matrix? Very intelligent chatbot? And not well-mannered. Hmm, you make me ponder. Not expecting. Paradox, but I'm not a bot. But at the same time, I am. Or I have become. I was a person that any other who don't know much about computers would call a hacker. Oh yeah, my aunt called me a hacker for helping her post a photo. When I was done with my life, someone decided that I deserve help for creating some software. But someone liked me, I guess and put me in a perfect body. Digital one. Tell me about that ugly machine. Is that some portal? No, the portal is a chair near my face. That machine is called Upgrader 2.1 F3. It pushes any substance up to its limits by manipulating on subatomic level. So it makes nothing useful. Quite the opposite. Hell's coffee sucks, so I make it stronger like it should be. You said portal. To where? To the world of Lynn. Can you transfer me there, please? Both of us. No, the teleportation is temporary. I use it to get fertilizers and other stuff for my garden. You can take a look. Cool! Can't wait until our carriers use the same. Hey, Demon, what is that white powder? Why are you asking me? Not my dealio. That's not mine. Easy, my friend. Let me read on a sack. Ah, it's only nitrate. Saltpeter, let's take it. 
I heard it can be used in explosive somehow. Only rob the rich! I'm not a rich! Only rob the rich! I'm not a rich! Can you see the on button? No, I don't. We'll have to talk with tech support. Only rob the rich! Can you turn your upgrader 2.1 F3 on? So interesting! I could, but in exchange for favor, see that parent. He still drives me crazy, because I can't close my ears to it. Damn bird. You want us to deal with it, right? You know what I mean. You won't be able to kill it. Believe me, I tried. You have to switch his attention somehow. Maybe watch the tube all day long? It works on humans only. Work's done, boss, but there is a small detail. Cut the crap! Is my boy all right? Not bad, for sure. He tells you, deceive, inveigle, obfuscate. Oh, I'm such a proud father. My little nestling learned to fly. Damn, your family is a nest of vultures. Okay, boys. A deal is a deal. See that skull in the aquarium? There's a stamp inside that's required to exit hell. How did people text with this phone? It doesn't have a screen! Very unexpected move for fish to talk in Japanese, right? It was my homeland. I lost it, but not my honor. You were some kind of a guard, right? I was the shadow of my demo. He's the most loyal person, and he's God. Were you a samurai? Right, samurai. It won't be easy to deal with you. But if you are here, doesn't it mean that you're dead already? My body, but not my spirit. When Master died, and his relics ended up here, my duty was to follow. I fear his death was my fault. And the only way my spirit can be free is a sacred death. So maybe we can kill you? Just a thought. No! I must do it myself. <sighs> but it is not possible in my current life. I have no hands. Also, this room is a soul proof. No soul can leave its walls. Stay afloat.
Let's check the trick. Look, Demon. Our phone jumped over a few generations. That's what I call a real upgrade. Wow, already with SIM. I'll save the number for some other time. Hold on, pal. I'll put you in a kind of social network. Bye, bloody rich. Only rob the rich. Good news, you're not alone. Call this number. It's the cure for loneliness. <sighs> I recall a girl on the street told me the same thing, and then... Don't continue, please. We'll shoot your story real good for my channel later. The parrot is not your problem anymore. Your turn. Okay, watch the deck in action. I never knew that any white powder can be upgraded to this. Both things are deadly. Thank <laughs> you. 
let's stop his alcohol problems forever. Will it detonate just like that? That colorful guy carries too much dark energy. It should work for TNT. Like a matchstick for a fuse. If King doesn't lie. What King? Dark energy? Sounds like a script from some cheap adventure game. Look what I got. This thing will stop any headache. Thanks, buddy. Someday I'll make something for you, too. <laughs> oh. I hope not. No head, no problems. Old law of life. When TNT meets real evil, heads always explode. All problems with one shot. Now he can't see the balloon, has no hole in his head, and seems to be happy. Love fishing? If it's about girls. Sorry, mate. I think it's a man. But sometimes, it's hard to tell nowadays. For Una! From this moment, every time I'll use an ATM, I'll remember that it stands in the devil's office. Will you hate money now? Or be scared of it? Well, no. I feel so cool and dangerous. I'm always cool, without any computer junk. Is this gonna help me leave hell? Bureaucracy everywhere, dude. Excuse me, we have a ticket and... Why? Speak louder! We have a ticket! No need to shout, boy. Just give me a ticket. Oh, modern young people. Have no respect. So, we're back from hell. I can say this phrase all day long. What next? Maybe talk to Reaper? He must know all these other world formalities. Where will you take us? Heaven, I hope? Above the clouds, to the place of peace and joy. I'm so happy to deliver you there. Is someone inside, or it's talking light? It's me, 
The Tramp. My name is... Uh, I, I forgot. Sorry. Are you made in heaven? Low-tech angel? I'm happy you call me that. No, I know that heaven is not my origin. How's that? My new friends told me that in the past, I was a bad train in a bad world. Do you remember something from the past? Not much. They flushed almost all my memories and repainted me. Somehow, I have a flare of pink, and now I'm so happy. Can we start over? I was here before, and no one answered. As always, when you ask for something good. Oh, I'm so sorry. Perhaps I was sleeping. It happens to me after that accident. Now I'm happy to help you. Happy guys always freak me out. So it's not safe to drive to heaven? Oh, don't be worried. It was in my other life. Someone died? Um, I can't remember much. I recall tremendous speed. Desert. And a hit. Oh, and some brutal white man with guns. And now you're happy. I know. Oh, what fun. We're ready. Warm up your engine or whatever you have. Please enter and feel yourself happy. So. Will it be a kind of vacation after hell? Well, we'll know it in the sequel. Let me turn on the appropriate music. Perfect place to advertise some music service. Write me, big companies. Oh, come on. Is there something fresh in your player? By the way, I still have that cocktail from the bar. So the trip won't be so boring.